I'm not dead. You know what? No! No, I can't take this anymore. Hit me, buddy. I know how you feel. I can't believe this. Son of a bitch. I am sick and tired of hearing about Black Lives Matter. This has been done before, trust me. If you don't believe me, look up All Lives Matter and you'll see the first five videos talking about All Lives Matter creating this straw man argument. Go ahead, just pause the video, look up All Lives Matter and see for yourself. Are you done? Okay, let's get on with the video. Matter, it should be All Lives Matter. The BLM movement is just stroking the flames of racism. Jeff? What? What are you doing? I'm making a Facebook post! Me and white guilt, two things that should not be mixed together. It's a very unhealthy thing. Okay, I want you to stop. I want you to think about this. But thinking is exactly what I don't want to do! You just need to take a moment and relax. But I'm angry now! Jeff, if you make that post, you're gonna look like an idiot! I'm surprised the amount of people who would be in support of this guy's post. Now, granted, Depending on your friends, you might receive some hate, but again, there will be people out there that would be in support of this because Black Lives Matter is not a movement that no one should be affiliated with. This guy right now is the fucking hero. Somebody has to speak the truth. If you say that black lives matter, you're saying that white lives don't matter, Hispanic lives don't matter, Native American lives don't matter. Why do black lives matters lose their fucking shit when we say all lives matter? Why do you lose your shit when we say blue lives matter? Hell, why do you lose your shit when white lives matter? Hell, there's a video on the internet of a Black Lives Matter activist losing their shit because some white guy decides to value his fucking life. Does all whites have value? Really? How? How so? Why does white life have value? Well, I think my For who? What? No, excuse me, for who? Our argument is that white life is wrong. Why? Our argument is our argument is that we should never affirm white life. That your white, argument of just white, affirming white, all life white, in general white. is not good. It's especially not good for black people when white life itself is based okay, off black of black life. You're probably white. And I know that this guy doesn't speak on behalf of all members of the Black Lives Matter community. But there are plenty of videos just like this that show that Black Lives Matter isn't exactly about black lives. Jeff, the BLM movement is not exclusionary, okay? It's merely focusing on the violence experienced by blacks from the police and the societal indifference about that injustice. Don't confuse me! You're making me feel stupid, and I'm not stupid! It should be against police brutality in general, not just towards black people. Think about it. If, um, say that I to spread awareness about children being uh, abused by their mothers, just being abused by their parents. And I point out that um, mothers are more likely to abuse their children than fathers. Would I say that we should focus on only the mothers because the mothers are more likely to abuse their child than the men? No, of course not. I would say that even though that women are more likely to abuse their children, um, men do the exact same thing, therefore we should be against um, child abuse in general. Just think about that for a moment. I know how I want the world to work. I mean, I know how the world works. And you're saying that all white people are racist. No, I'm not. Stuart would like to say hi. All white people are racist. All men are misogynistic. All cisgender people are transphobic. All members of a majority are biased against the members of the minority or oppressed group. White people have problems too. You know, a friend of mine had a friend that was shot by police and he was white. That evidence is anecdotal. It's not anecdotal. It's not. You, you clearly do not understand what anecdotal means. Well, how do you expect me to make an argument for all lives matter unless I use my anecdotal evidence? Go online, do some actual research, find some real statistics. I tell you the exact same thing! There is literally video after video after video after video of black
Black Lives Matter are becoming very destructive, saying that they should kill fucking cops. They have no problem with killing cops. They have no problem with killing white people. They don't feel any sympathy. And hell, they even disrupted a gay parade because there's not enough gay people in it. I mean, not enough black people in it. Now, I understand that you're just trying to spread the message, but if your message consists of violence and interrupting other people's parades, then I have to say you're not a peaceful movement at all. And I understand that you're going to just burst out and say, no, that's just, you know, a very small minority. No, fuck you. If this was just one event, you know, just a, a few events here and there, then I would have said, fine, okay, fine. Black Lives Matter is actually legitimately caring about uh, black lives, about anti-police brutality. And I will call out the extremists. But this has happened so many goddamn times that I cannot say that Black Lives Matter is legitimately caring about black lives and instead is anti-white and anti-cop. Here's a good site, glenbeck.com. No, Jeff, abort, abort. It says that more white people get shot by police than black people. The, the white population is five times greater than the black population. People commit more crime than white people. Um, so I guess I should be very afraid of the next black person who's going, who, who's near me. Because who knows, he might actually have a knife in his pocket. Yeah, that's your fucking logic right there. Look, it's my statistic. Don't use it against me. Now I'm just gonna tag all of my black friends to this post. Oh my god. So my black friends are... Uh... Brad? Brad, yes, and... Um... Carl? Carl, and... Oh, oh Denise! I know that one. Oh, wait. Is she black? Let me see what kind of music she likes. Oh, you racist son of a bitch. Why are you only sharing with black people? I mean... Isn't that a bit stupid? Shouldn't everyone see that? Including white people? I thought I had more black friends than this. You don't, Jeff, because you live in a white bubble and you don't know the black experience. That means he never been to middle school. Or high school. Because the black experience is literally in our history books. I mean, you don't really have to do a lot of fucking research to understand black history. They literally teach you at high school. It's I even got an I even got an attest from that. And I aced it. Hey, I saw 12 Years a Slave. I get it. What did you conclude from that? That slavery was bad, but it's over now, so black people are fine. Oh my god, how could I not get this? Come on! Unless you've been, you're over 80 years old, they literally teach you everything about slavery and the Jim Crow laws. How old are you? What, 30, 40? Did they not teach you about anything? About black lives? About history? Anything? Are you fucking stupid? Are you fucking retarded? I mean, what is wrong with me? Jeff, tell myself what's going on. I was told when I was growing up that if I worked hard, I would succeed, but I haven't. Didn't I read Death of a Salesman in high school? I should be prepared for this. Look, I need someone to blame, and I blame black people. I mean, black lives matter. There's that white guilt again. I don't have a problem with Brad and Carl. Carl, we just at least post about something else on Facebook because I would like to go to Brad's Super Bowl party this year. Do it. Damn! Criticize Black Lives Matter. It, it's good for you. Oh, that's right. He's got the great chili dip. Yeah. How about if I blame it on gay marriage? No, Jeff. Muslims? No. Illegal immigrants? Can we not focus on a people or ethnic group? I got it. The moon landing was faked. Ooh, a conspiracy theory. Harmless, a little kooky, but most of your friends will think it's funny rather than be offended by it. Okay, Jeff. You can write that the moon landing was faked. Great. The moon landing was faked as part of a Jewish conspiracy theory. And this is why your wife left you. Basically, his entire argument can be labeled that as don't write anything offensive, because if you do, people will hate you. And you know, don't target Black Lives Matter, because Black Lives Matter is good. Huh? Meredith, is that you? The worst satirical video I have yet to see. I am the atheist gamer. Keep gaming on. Get the f out of here! Get the f out of here! Nobody! Remember, 
Black Lives Matter rally Sunday night shut down the I-40 bridge with hundreds of protesters refusing to leave. Traffic could not go across, but paramedic Bobby Harrell with Crittenden EMS had to get to that baby with his family stuck on the bridge. Help! 